Welcome to 24 Days of Drops, an Animal Crossing New Horizons advent calendar that reveals a new build for a differently themed island entrance each day until Christmas. Are you ready for today's theme? Hello! And welcome to day 11 of our Animal Crossing New Horizons advent calendar. Today we are tackling a more festive build, if you if you will. Um, it's not really festive. It's not technically Christmas. It's um, it's we're gonna build a North Pole. I've been thinking about this build for a long time. Actually, I was gonna build an entire island based around this theme. I can feel tons of coughs coming on, by the way. So I'm extremely sorry. Um, if that's gonna be dominating in this video, so I'm gonna try to suppress it and pause and mute myself, which I have to do right now. Okay, yeah, I've returned. Stunning. <clears throat> I've been I've been really excited for this build. It's it's on a, on the shorter side because this is for a very story driven island. I imagine that this would be the starting point, obviously being you know the entrance to an island, and we're gonna have a pipe somewhere hidden um behind one of the caves so that you can jump in there and then that would transport you to like Santa's little village with like all the elves and his little helpers um wandering around, wrapping presents, building toys, all that stuff. So I think that that would technically give bring you there, which is a very much inspired by the Santa Claus movies. I'm not sure if you're familiar with those, but they, they have always been kind of our family favorite to watch um, since we were little. Very, very funny movies, by the way. But they have this scene where there's this pole, um, I think it's in the first movie, and there's like, you know, they don't really know what's going on with the with the whole North Pole, Santa Claus thing, and I... <coughs> that was too quick to mute, I'm sorry. <clears throat> and um, there's this little elf coming along, and they like, kind of pull a little pole from the ground, touch it and like, type something in, and then that kind of sinks their sleigh into the ground, and that opens the entire world to the center village. So that was kind of what inspired this. Oh my God, my cough is terrible. Oh, this is gonna be so annoying. I hate this. <coughs> Why? Why? I mean, it probably wasn't the smartest idea of me to take, you know, those eucalyptus kind of cough, cold drop thingies. Um, not really to keep in your mouth, but you you swallow them whole like a like a like any other pills that you would take, and they are supposed to like free your whole like what? How do you call that? We we call it we call it nimhuen, which is like your nostrils and and your mouth and like your throat throat. It also goes into your jaw and your everything to kind of free that up and make you you know breathe again and kind of like loosen your cough if that makes any sense. Um, I took one of those. <coughs> which was absolutely stupid of me to do because I've already coughed like four times in three minutes which I absolutely adore but that's okay you know that's what we're here for it's the it, it's the it's the season of the cold okay Christmas season is also season of being sick and everyone's sick and that's okay and I should just stop talking about it because that's not why you tune into my videos is it right mm -hmm. but i also feel a bit like shit today so if this is less edited i'm very very sorry uh, i'm gonna try to flop in a couple of knickknacks here and there and but this is also a very short build so i hope that this is okay for you but i also like to kind of mix it up for for some of you guys because you know some of you may may appreciate a shorter video some may appreciate a longer one and i'm not gonna stretch stuff out if it's if it's not gonna be enough because technically this was just a lot of foliage work a lot of layering kind of items and this is more about the illusion so technically like the cliffs that we're going to do later they look a bit strange up close but i paid more attention to what they look like from the entrance because as you hop into the pipe that wouldn't really you know you wouldn't really get a chance to look at the cliffs because there wouldn't be an incline leading up onto one of them or so like we usually see so i just kind of tried to make it look good from the actual entrance and have like more of a perspective build you will see what i mean by that in the end because you, we will actually flop in a little center sleigh with some reindeers which i really really like and i really loved putting this at night time and then having all the illuminated item and the festive trees and like the glowing moss items we're gonna have some illuminated snowflakes some illuminated reindeer it's really really pretty and I also like that we didn't use any flowers because I don't like how the flowers look at winter when you're going for like a frozen theme kind of like similarly to what I did for the very first build that we did for the Edmund calendar which was this frozen castle and I just didn't feel like flowers matched the vibe quite well right um so 
because of the, the green bits that it has and, and I, I just thought you know what no it's not time for that and I really like the glowing moss in the winter time because it looks actually frozen like little water drops that may have fallen onto the ground which definitely happens oh my god <clears throat> what is going on now I hate this but yeah we're just going to be plonking in a couple of a couple of trees here and there so I don't have too much to talk about right there but I hope that you've all been well it's nearly halfway through our advent calendar already it's so crazy because it feels like like obviously you know I have recorded more builds than I uploaded so I am through more than halfway of the advent calendar but still like it's crazy to think that this is already halfway done because when you get like so excited for something for months, I think I feel like it's the same thing with like normal Christmas time, right? You get excited for this time of year, so like all year long, and you prepare and you decorate your house and whatever, or your home rather. Not everyone owns a house. I don't own a house, and it's so crazy how fast time flies by. It's it's ridiculous, and I hate it so much. I feel like you know it's weird to say this when you're 23, but. I feel like I'm just running out of time. It's so crazy. I feel, I don't know. It's very strange. And I feel like the years just keep speeding up. And I never understood it when my mum said that to me when I was little. But Jesus Christ. Anyway, I'm rambling. Why am I going, about, going on about the fucking meaning of life here? Hey you, it's Intermission Nina here. I have edited out so much coughing out of this stunning voiceover. But I had to I had to come back in and save the day. And not leave you with your own thoughts as I said in the past. Was that in the past? Or did I say that in the video that I haven't uploaded there? That's actually an issue that I've been having. I am so scared of spoiling something on stream in a video. Be like, oh, that and that theme. Or, oh, I said this and this. And no, I haven't I haven't talked about that yet. It's not live yet, Nina. I always want to go on about things that I've already built and I can't really share them yet. It's done in. But anyway, we're done with this intermission. And um, yeah. We are on top of the cliff now. And we're going to be building that little center sleigh thingy. So initially I put up these taller trees but then you couldn't really see the reindeer from the front so I decided to remove the, the taller trees you will see that in just a second and I'm going to move the reindeer forward so that they are really the focal point and we're also, also going to be using the toy day sleigh in a second so that it actually looks like they are pulling the sleigh or obviously you could like use some like ski tracks or codes or something like that I have done some in the past so if you are interested in any of them I can if I remember to flop them in the comment section below if you would like to pop them underneath of this. But since this was more of a perspective build, I didn't really think that it was necessary. And most of the bottom of this is covered anyway, because I don't like the thingy, the black little thingies that the reindeer sit on, which by the way, I don't understand why Nintendo did that. Like why would you create black frames that they sit on if this is obviously made for winter time, like make it white, make it green, okay? If you wanna be very, very correct and also give our uh, Southern Hemisphere people, you know, a, a very nice thing to match their island. But why the fuck would you make it black? That doesn't match any island. I don't understand. Make it white, please. That makes so much more sense. Do I have it sit in the snow? Make it customizable so that people can exchange the color. I don't understand why you would make it black. That's the least convenient color that you could have picked please Nintendo that is ridiculous and I am very fuming about it thank you very much anyway I also wanted to have a good mixture of the festive trees and the normal trees up here because I felt like the baby baby tabletop kind of festive trees just look so cute from afar because they just look like mini trees in the distance and I just love it so much it's really really cute we're also going to be using some of the dormant volcanoes and the cave items up here just to kind of densen this up because obviously since you're not going to be able to get up on top of the cliff I kind of just wanted this to be enclosed like a u-shape around the entrance and then you know have the rest of the island behind that the whole north pole village or even like i could even see some like polar express kind of vibe going on here i think that would also be really really cute and i think like if you're interested i i would even do another build maybe like around christmas to kind of show you what i mean by this whole center village how i would build a center village i don't even know how i would do that in this game but i could definitely see myself adding another entrance build that wouldn't have to be an entrance build it could also just be a build that you would land on if you were to hop in the pipe in this build for example obviously this build doesn't exist anymore i haven't already flattened it weeks ago 
ago um <clears throat> as i am recording this right now but i think that could be really really cute to have like a little center's workshop winter wonderland not winter wonderland but you know what i'm trying to say right like a north pole where they actually create the toys and stuff i think that could be really really cute and uh, like an actual cute island and i feel like people have made islands like that before so maybe that's a maybe that's a thing that could be interesting to any of you might be a bit late if it's around christmas but you know i want to have a christmasy build i've actually tried to have like more winter christmasy themed builds around these sundays as you know i've mentioned before those are the advent sundays so technically this is also today is the third one by the way happy happy third advent i hope you're having a lovely sunday my love but that is also what i have chosen the more festive or Christmassy themed or winter themed builds for the Sundays. So maybe, maybe either next Sunday or for Christmas we can do something nice and nice and Christmassy to add on to this. But we only have like a minute left, so I'm gonna be popping on a couple more details on top of these cliffs. I am actually not gonna detail these cliffs up here, like the second layer of cliffs, up too much. I just wanted them to have an elevated Dormon volcano to look like a mountaintop and I obviously didn't want to have any items around it because then that kind of takes away the illusion of it actually being a mountain. So this is looking a bit bare, bare towards the end but you can't really see this backside too much anyway. I just didn't know how to stop building so that's why I kind of kept going and going and adding more items. But that's really about it. I think I'm only going to go to the front a bit more and decorate, yeah, to the right of the entrance because there was a very barren little wasteland and that didn't look too finished. Um, I could have done the same to the left, but that already was sort of completely looking from the cliffs that we had back there because I already did that earlier. So I'm really, really pleased with this. Thank you so much for spending your time with me today. I am very, very excited to be sharing this one. I really think this is a cute theme and I think that you could actually do an island like this. And I love having like more story driven builds. So hopefully this was something that you liked. I hope you're gonna have a wonderful rest of your Sunday or whenever you decide to watch this. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. By the way, thank you so, so much. I have put up a community post the other day thanking you lot for just being here and tuning in and just watching multiple of these builds. I really do appreciate you taking the time out of your day to actually, you know, flopping in here um, because Christmas is a busy time. And I actually didn't realize that at, that at first that, you know, maybe an advent calendar would be very overwhelming to people. So I hope that this was actually an okay thing to do. But, you know, thank you very, very much for tuning in. I appreciate you all very, very much. And I'm gonna see you tomorrow for the next one or whenever you decide to tune in. I'm gonna leave you now with a montage of this finished product, my love. Have a wonderful rest of your day and take care of yourself. Bye. -bye.